why it's hot day I'm hanging in the sunshine You should hit me with a splash gun So I cool down Won't you come on over We can party till the sun's down Baby let me buy you a drink While we're dancing to blink I could go for some Queen B2 Bass is going today and we need to get out of here soon and I decided to have a huge complicated breakfast so that's fun for me so yesterday oh hi by the way I'm Ichiwi I'm on a weight loss journey I'm very busy I'm a little scatterbrained yesterday I only got 60 grams of protein in my goal is 100 so this morning rather than have a whole bunch of breakfasty foods I want to focus mainly on protein I'm doing shrimp I'm doing chicken that's it uh, there's not that many sources that I'm using. But I'm baking the chicken, the shrimp has to cook. I'm going to pair it with one serving. One serving of this is 56 grams dry for 210 calories, seven grams of protein, 41 carbohydrates. So the breakfast I have planned is more of a dinner type meal, but you don't always have to have breakfast foods for breakfast. I'm planning my breakfast this morning based off of the fact that I missed protein goals yesterday. And I know today is going to be physically taxing. The wind and the waves from yesterday's sailing was kind of spicy and today is supposed to be even spicier. So kayaking is going to expend a lot of energy and I will get very hungry and very tired if I don't do this right. We are going to kayak out against the waves. So coming back should be nice and easy. But yeah, we're making it so that we can only kayak out for two hours against waves as a fail safe plan. And speaking of planning, the breakfast is going to have carbohydrates, fats, and protein. So I'm kind of making a little bit of two separate meals. Steven doesn't eat certain seafood. He does eat seafood, but it has to be cooked a certain way or it has to be a certain type. I'll eat all of it. He also is on a keto diet, whereas I am on a balanced lifestyle diet. I don't know how else to say it. I eat all of it. I just like to keep portion control under it. 
So we're gonna have chicken with Alfredo sauce. That's on both of our plates. And then he's gonna get some fried eggs. I'm gonna have shrimp and some pasta. I don't know how much of this was a cohesive thought. I, I am running around right now. And I had to send Steven out for Alfredo sauce because uh, I thought I had some. And I already planned this meal and I already popped the chicken in. So <laughs> there's no turning back. In case this was all a bit of a jumbled mess here, breakfast. Important to plan what you're doing for the day around your breakfast maybe. So the chicken is gonna cook for 40 minutes. The shrimp is already boiling. Uh, I have to wait for it to cool off a little bit so then I can take off the, the shell and not burn my fingers. I need to heat up the Alfredo sauce, probably season it a bit, boil some noodles, and get the mushrooms and onions nice and sauteed in there and fry up a couple eggs. So since I am so busy and scatterbrained, I will cook this. I'll show you some of it maybe, but I will show you the end result and the calorie count. They call me sassy when I'm strolling down the street. They call me classy when I'm serving just the best. I can be deadly when I find somebody lovely. And now I'm ready like a kitty in a dress. Do you guys want to see what I did? What's missing here? <sighs> Got my setup. Batteries are on the charger right now. You can't turn the tide. Let the water go where it wants. Steven is driving. It helps distract me, keep my eyes off the road. 
because my eyes aren't worth anything when it comes to someone else driving. So I have some thoughts. We couldn't have planned that better if we tried and we did try and it was planned greatly. The water was glass, but we recognized where the wind was coming from on the way back. Uh, the waves picked up, the wind picked up, so it was a nice cool breeze even though it is freaking hot out. We had a nice breeze on our backs. I dipped my, my UV shirt in water so and my hat. Also, don't wear black hats in the sun. I don't know why I didn't think of that. <laughs> we planned it perfectly. It was a five mile all around trip. There were herons flying around really gorgeous shots. Again, I don't know if my camera will get it. It's it's not meant for nature shots. It's meant to vlog so the lens isn't, you know, long distance. I saw tons of jellyfish and I didn't know we had jellyfish and they're, they're little white ones. So I'm gonna have to look up and see what those are so I can tell you guys. I saw a crab. Uh, I didn't know starfish bred like alien plagues but it's still cool to see. It, it was just really a great trip. And on the way back, you know, I, I did less cameraing because you guys have already seen a lot of it. And I just really soaked up how gorgeous it was. Like the breeze, the wet shirt, the waves pushing us forward. It, it was great. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. That's the only word I can describe it. Magnificent, glorious, uh, magical. It was great. The only downside is that I forgot, and I hate to bring it up because I kept saying it while we were kayaking, but my fake GoPro, it's an Alaska, 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 it has a waterproof case, and so all of those sea creatures underwater, I could have dipped my camera underwater so you guys could have seen it in a better clear shot so it's not rippled water, you know? If that's the worst thing I have to complain about, it's been a damn good day. Other than that, it's two o'clock. I forgot the sandwiches also. I didn't just forget the battery. I forgot sandwiches, but I'm not hungry. That was a huge breakfast. I am still full from it. So it's gonna probably be, wait, you're making chicken tonight, right? Yeah, we might wait till late, it's gonna be hot. Yeah, so it's gonna be a lot later and it's gonna be like chicken and sun-dried tomatoes. I'm probably not gonna do a calorie count on it. It's gonna be a low calorie count. I'm gonna do the listen to my body after eating and if I'm still hungry, I'll choose healthy snacks. Simple as that. So this is gonna be it for today. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope that I inspired you guys to get outside. I mean, even looking at a blade of grass intensely can be interesting. So, you know, go touch some grass or, or just enjoy the air conditioning depending on, you know, your heat. Just enjoy your day, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye!